Hey, Translash family, it's me, Amara Jones, with our holiday week Translash talk back. But before I get into the news of the week, yeah, there's still things going on, despite the fact that it's the holidays, I wanted to be sure to give a shameless plug for our annual holiday survival guide zine that we at Translash put together. There's so many things to get you through the holidays if that's what you need. There is poetry by Sawai Fam and Mojo Disco. There are reflections on the year by yours truly. There's art, there are interviews, there are other pieces of reflection by members of our team. There's pages and pages and pages of content to dig into. So make sure that you do that and please do that because we spent a lot of time putting it together. And also make sure if you have time and the ability to check out Transanta. There are tons of trans people that are still going to that site put together by India Moore and Chase Rangio and so many other people to be able to provide for trans youth who need things during the holidays. So go there, it's so easy, I did it, and you can too. So on to some things that are happening this week. We had Eddie Izzard, the longtime British comic who has said that their pronouns are officially she, her. We're so happy they've been on a long gender journey. As I've said before, gender is a journey. They're continuing that journey and embracing themselves. And so of course our community is supportive of that. This is also the time of family. And so we're all into family stories. And we had a young trans youth, Luca, write um, a note to their mom. Talking about the fact that they were trans and getting accepted in the process. On the not so good news, we have some moves out of Washington. A bill that's being sponsored by Senators uh, Ben Sass, who's a Republican, and Senator Merkley from Oregon, who is a Democrat, to curtail the adult content industry, which is going to have a really big and negative impact on our community. And we'll be digging into that next year. But in the meantime, dig into our zine.